My name is Robert Nairn, and I'm going to talk to you for a very short while today about an essay I submitted to the Scottish Agricultural College as part of the MSC Countryside Management course I'm currently undertaking. Uh, the essay had to be written on a topic which is currently topical in agriculture. Uh, I chose to write my essay on the sustainability of livestock production in the Highlands of Scotland if direct payments are to be withdrawn. Firstly, what is a direct payment? A direct payment is a payment made from the state directly to a farmer. A farmer being a producer of an agricultural commodity in the Highlands could be a doctor. Also, that farmer does not have to compete against other farmers to receive the payment. The main form of direct payment today is the basic payment scheme. Why is it a topical issue at the moment? Well, as we all know, on the 29th of March, the UK is due to leave the EU. And since 1973, when the UK joined the EEC, as it was known then, the overarching framework dealing with agricultural policy has been the common agricultural policy. And on the 29th of March, the UK will be leaving the common agricultural policy. Um, the essay looked at what would happen if direct payments were withdrawn today, immediately. The findings were quite stark. All of the highlands of Scotland, well, the true highlands, the, the upland areas, are designated as LFA, less favoured areas. Today, without direct payments, the average suckler cow in the LFA regions of Scotland loses £195.54 a year. The average hill sheep in the LFA region of Scotland loses £17.53 a year. These findings were from Quality Meat Scotland and based on the year 2017. The SA looked into why this was the case and how uh, the case could be changed. Are inputs too high? Well, the findings found that inputs could be reduced slightly around the margins but probably at the end of the day would not make too much of a difference to this loss. Is the end price of the agricultural commodity too cheap? Well if you looking at uh, the current agricultural media you can see that Scotch beef is one of the dearest, if not the dearest, beef carcass in the world. Scotch lamb isn't quite there, but it's not far behind. Is there other forms of agricultural support available to these producers? Yes, well, currently there are forms of support such as the Agri-Environment Climate scheme, Change Scheme. Nearly all producers can apply to that to farm in a more environmentally sensitive way and receive financial awards. Also in the Highlands, an awful lot of producers are crofters and crofters have had uh, the crofting agricultural grant scheme available to them for many, many years now. It uh, supplies funding for things like drainage, fences, sheds. Still, the average business makes a substantial loss. Um, the findings of the essay basically said that if direct payments were to be withdrawn, livestock production in the Highlands of Scotland would be unsustainable, unless major, major change occurs. Thank you very much for listening. Good night.